So then ready for the uh, kick-off here at the uh, Stade de Moroni. There's a chance in the middle, picked up here by Kosovi, and it's... Has it gone in? Yes, it has. And Togo have taken the lead here in Comoros. It was a scrappy goal where they all count, and Lava Koju Fodu there has managed to put the ball in the back of the net. The goalkeeper's going to be disappointed, so too the man on the line for Comoros. There's the shot there, and it was unable to be cleared. And the assistant over there clearly... Lawson, better ball into the middle, and the header comes in from Lava, is saved, and then it's gone into the side, netting from the centre forward. Well, that's the best real chance in the game, you'd have to say. Completely beat the offside, trapped in Lava, and then just couldn't quite get it the other side of the goalkeeper. And Komaros there with a real let-off, they completely lost him. It's a direct free kick, so he can go for goal, and it's uh, picked up and scored, and there's the equaliser. And they are back in this. And it looks as though it's Ibrahim Aduja who's getting the congratulations on that far side. What a start to the second half from the home side, Comoros. Well, it wasn't the most dangerous free kick from Benyud Yusuf, but the goalkeeper, Basagieri, did not really deal with it. And the home fans finally have something to cheer. Comoros are in this World Cup qualifying campaign at the end of this first leg of qualifying for African Zone World Cup. It has finished. Comoros won, Togo won. Second leg to come on Tuesday.